This video is going to look at the marginal revenue curves for businesses in perfect competition and in a monopoly. In perfect competition, the marginal revenue curve is a horizontal line like this. This marginal revenue. The reason is that in perfect competition, the business cannot affect its price level which it received. So the price received in this example will say equals P1, and the business has to charge that price. So that means for every additional product they sell, they get extra revenue or they get the marginal revenue just equal to that price which is charged, and we end up with a line that looks like this. A monopoly, however, is different. A monopoly is able to set its price. So at lower, at lower output levels, the monopoly will charge a higher price. And as they sell more and more product, they're able to ch uh, charge a lower price for each additional level of output. So that means that the extra revenue they receive is less, which means the marginal revenue is less at greater output levels and that leads to a downward sloping marginal revenue curve. In both examples, the best position for the business to operate in is at the intersection of the marginal cost and marginal revenue curves. If you're not sure why that is the profit maximizing level in which to operate, you should watch the video on this channel called Marginal Cost and Marginal Revenue.